Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Janai. If you're new here, please like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and follow me on Instagram. It's in the description box down below. So today I am doing a get unready with me. I just finished filming two videos, so now I need to wash all this stuff off my face and i decided to just film it because i wanted to film three videos today but i'm kind of tired and i don't want to go through the effort of figuring something out so let's get right into the video and i just wanted to add that i decided to also just while i'm taking off my makeup and everything to talk about what i plan for my channel what i think the future of my channel will look like and I guess I'll talk about that too so it's not completely boring and you know the makeup taking off process isn't too long and I'm gonna shower so I don't know if I'm gonna wash my face in the shower or out of the shower so we'll see but yeah filming multiple videos in one day is definitely beneficial but it's really tiring and I still have other stuff to do okay so I am in my bathroom now I am about to wipe off I'm about to wipe off my makeup. It looks really beat up. I just ate dinner, so the lip gloss that I was wearing is gone now. Yeah, I need to find makeup wipes. I'm just like sitting here talking. So I said that I would talk about the future of my channel, and I was kind of going for a lifestyle vibe before, but I really don't know what lifestyle is, to be honest. I was kind of thinking that it was just me living my life and doing whatever I wanted to do because I couldn't, you know, niche down or I think it's, yeah, niche down, niche down, niche, I think it's niche. I don't want to be a beauty guru because, and I don't want to be a gamer because those are really popular categories and I didn't want to do either of those. So I kind of liked how broad, you know, lifestyle is. And I think going forward, I'm going to put more effort into my videos than I already do. You know, I think right now I'm doing I'm doing good, but I could totally do better. I want to start, you know, planning more for the videos so that they can come out better and then I can figure out more editing techniques and everything. So I think what I'm trying to say is that in the future, my editing is going to get better, my film is going to get better and all of that, and maybe my ideas will also get better. So that's kind of, I guess, what I am going to be doing next. That's where I'm going to be going moving forward. So lately I've been just trying random things. Like I did a reaction on my channel. You guys are gonna see a clothing video that should have already come out, I think I believe last week. This should be coming out on a Monday, so last week Friday. I think for the most part, I have been pretty good with being consistent. You know, I haven't been really lacking to be honest. I think I've only missed like two weeks of posting once. So now I'm trying to post twice a week. If you haven't noticed, Mondays and Fridays, I used to post every Friday. Starting in, I think, November with my Mac call videos. So you should go watch that if you haven't. So I'm trying to post more, be better at consistency, do more planning so you guys can get better videos, video quality. Cause I do think my quality is actually pretty good for such a new channel. Channel, to be honest especially since I film on my note 8 by the way if you guys didn't know but I totally think I could finesse this enough to make it like really really good because I think I'm kind of like here but I can make it like here just by putting like way 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 more effort into it I think I need to really plan it out more because you know obviously I have classes and school and like a life so I have to find time to do videos edit and everything so if I start planning and doing everything earlier then I will be able to put out much better content because over time I will be able to like edit and get everything up because right now usually when I post on Fridays what I would do is I would come up with the idea film it and edit it all on the same day that's why my videos were coming out so late but i believe it's gonna be at this point like two weeks ago i posted a video on friday and it is a books video a book recommendation video so i'm gonna put that up there and then i posted another one on monday and it was about netflix and hulu tv show recommendations and those videos came out at about 2 30 on both those days and that is because i took the time to film both videos on one day and then i edited it and i got it out to you guys so much faster and it was just nicer you know i like posting earlier in the day and having everything planned it's literally like nine o'clock right now and scheduled to be posted because it just makes my life easier and it makes me feel accomplished so that's kind of what i'm trying to do is what i'm saying so just being like more consistent and being on top of everything myself because obviously I'm graduating soon and I don't know how I'm supposed to film in a dorm. Like I don't know how that's gonna work, but I'm gonna make it work because you know, I'm dedicated now. It's been way too long. I'm too far in, I'm not gonna give up. So y'all are gonna be stuck seeing my face a lot, twice a week. As of right now, I don't know what my life's gonna be in a few months, but. Okay, so I'm gonna wash my face now. 
because I've been talking a lot. This was in my morning routine video, but when I wash my face at my sink, I use the, I don't even know how to say it, Bior, Bior, B-I-O-R-E. It's a charcoal face wash and it's got the bees in it, I think. So it's like a face scrub. And this is only what I use when I'm at my sink. So a lot of times I wash my face in the shower when I'm showering and that just makes it easy because you know, you're already in the water. And I use the Noxzema face wash. The Noxzema stuff works amazing. Whenever I break out, that stuff really like pulls my face back together. So, so I'm gonna wet my face and wash it real quick. Okay, so I just finished washing my face, but to all the makeup wearing people out there, if you wear makeup, you gotta make sure you take it off properly. So don't use like one face wipe, use like a couple. Make sure that thing isn't coming off with a lot of foundation, whatever you got on your face, and you have to wash your face. Because if you're wondering why you break out, that might be a reason, I don't know. Cause sometimes I will get really lazy and I take off my makeup, but then I wouldn't wash my face for a while. But just make sure right after you just wash your face and get that over with. And don't go to sleep with makeup on, please. Before I put my face lotion, which is the Neutrogena Oil-Free Moisturizer for combination skin. I've been using this for a while, but it works for me. I got it at like Walgreens or CVS or something, I think. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm gonna brush my teeth first. And one more piece of advice for people who wear glasses like I do. Every time I wash my face, I wash my glasses also because your glasses can build dirt and oil from your face and you know, you sweat. So you have to make sure you wash your glasses too because you'll get breakouts like around your nose and the side of your face like right here. I just got out of the shower. I'm all tired now. So now I am going to put on chapstick. I've been using the Arts Bees regular the regular one lately it's been working pretty good i used the aquaphor one before that one was nice but the application was a little bit more messy because it wasn't like a stick it was like one of those ones that you squeeze out but i do not like the claramex Clara, you know i'm just gonna put it right here but the caramex the one with the red top and the yellow bottom that one it makes your lips dry if you don't use it it's it's not good just don't use that one i'm gonna put lotion on my face now I'm gonna show you guys how I put on my bonnet. So usually when I get braids, I just do like a split them in two and wrap them around. But since the end of this is curly, it's like the same thing. I take the two parts and then I twist it at the back once and I bring it forward. And I take these ends because I don't want them to get messed up. So I just like twist it like this all the way until it gets to the end. And then I do the same for the other side. And I don't make the twists like really intense, just enough to like loosely get it. I'm not really sure if this is like the right way to do things, but this is how I started doing it. So I twist it and then I take an elastic and I put it like this. You don't want to do it too tight so the hair doesn't get any like creases. And then I take my bonnet and I put it in the front hold the back, loop it, and then get it under like that. And the reason why I do the back and like bring it around and cross it once is because when you sleep, it just makes it a lot easier. So there's no bump at the back of your head and it kind of is nice and smooth. I'm about to go do laundry and it is literally late o'clock. <laughs> So I'm gonna go do laundry. Well, anyways, thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and follow me on Instagram. It's in the description box down below. Go watch the rest of my videos, send it to everybody that you know, and come back for more videos Mondays and Fridays.